Hey, welcome back. It's been a while since I've seen you. Oh, who's your friend? Hi, it's nice to meet you. I'm, uh, I'm Dom. I, uh, I run the cafe here. Uh, what can I get you? Okay. Sure thing. Just give me one second. What's that? Oh, you want it to go? Yeah, no worries. All right. Uh, so, where are you two off to? A date. Wow. You, yeah, that's that's great. Um, yeah. Let me just get these coffees ready for you two, and I'll be right back. Oh yeah, the um the reception in here can be kind of uh kind of spotty, so you might have better luck outside. <sighs> What's that? Well, what do you mean, what? <laughs> I'm just making both your coffees. No, no, I'm not. <laughs> I mean, why why would I be upset? I'm just um just, uh, stressed, I guess. You know how it is. Erica, would you shut up, please? Thank you. Um, anyway, here you go. Here's your order. And, uh, hope you have a nice day. No, I'm, I'm fine. Really. Um, I guess I'm just surprised. Uh, nothing. I just, I mean, I don't know. I guess your date doesn't. I don't know, doesn't really seem like your type. Well, I guess I don't know that for sure, but I just... <laughs> I don't know, I never thought you'd be into the, the airhead type. I am not being rude, alright? I'm just stating a fact. I mean, your date couldn't even figure out if the door was push or pull, and it's written on the door. So, oh come on, you don't believe that. Fine. No, no, fine, fine, I'll drop it. Yeah, whatever, all right? Sorry. I'll see you around, okay? <sighs> Shit. Yeah, Erica, I'm aware of that, okay? I just... I mean, a date? I... Look, I just never thought they were going to bring a date in here, Okay. No, of course not. I wouldn't expect them to, like, not date anyone because of me. They can date whoever they want, all right? That's fine. It's it's their right, obviously. <sighs> yeah, no, I'm not happy, but I get it, all right? There's nothing I can do about it. I, I made my choice, I guess. <sighs> Erica, will you please just drop it? I'm serious. Because what's the point? I mean, so what if I confess how I feel? And yeah, they might decide to date me, but do you get what the consequences would be if you're wrong? I mean, they'd be gone forever. And I just, I really don't want that. And at least this way, they're still kind of in my life, at least. <sighs> oh, come on. I'm not being a martyr. You know what? You're probably right. Maybe I am an idiot, but so what? All right? It doesn't matter. I made my decision, and that's something that I have to live with. Look, Erica, I really appreciate that you're trying to help and give me advice. Like, look, you're a good friend. You are. But I'm serious. I think you're wasting your time with this one. It's not giving up. It's just I'm, I'm accepting the inevitable, okay? I mean, I knew that one day this was going to happen. I'm not stupid or naive I've just I've lost a lot in my life okay and I've made a lot of choices and some were good and some I really regret but at the end of the day I own up to everything that I've done okay it's made me who I am and sure it would be great to live happily ever after with them but this is not a fairy tale Erica this is reality the truth is, I'm just not willing to risk it right now. Yeah, maybe. But look, even if I do, it's still my choice, and I wouldn't change it, alright? 
Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to be a disappointment right now. <sighs> well, thanks, Erica. I appreciate you trying to look out for me. You know what, actually, why don't you go, um, why don't you go take a break for a bit? No, no, it's fine. I can finish up here. All right. I know you're late to your lunch, so go on. Go take a break. Okay. Yeah, I'll see you in 30. Oh, shit. Way to go, me. Way to really fight for what you want. <laughs> 